Hmm, Jailbreaking is Dead by Artweeks, who's one of the most popular jailbreak tech YouTubers. I guess I gotta make a Siri Tweaks video. What's up guys, this is Profile Tech. Today I'm collaborating with Chevron Salmon to show you the best Siri Tweaks in July and also to respond to Artweeks. In addition, if you're asking about Chevron Salmon, why he didn't upload for one full week, he's going to come back next week with new gear and he'll come back better than ever. Starting the list with Lethesia X, hopefully I'm spelling it right, anyway the spelling is written on the screen and that week is directly taken from iOS 11, it gives you iOS 11 music player and it works perfectly. The next week is Alternate Controls 2 which is taken directly from Android to your iPhone which is the Android control buttons. If you came from Android to iOS and you'd like to have these buttons, you can get them with this tweet. They all work perfectly, for example, when you click that button, it's going to go to the app switcher. When you click the home button, obviously it's going to go to the home button. Let's go to settings app and click the home button. It's going to go back to the home button. And when you're in the settings app, for example, and you go to one of the sections and you'd like to go back, you can click that button and it's going to go back to the original settings page. The best thing about that tweak that you have a lot of options of in the settings of alternate controls. As you see, you can control the icon, control the color, background color, and you have all these options. Now let's talk about the swipe location. When I swipe in the right section over there, I can get the controls over here. And if I want the control center, I can slide from the left side or the left section. As you see, I can get my control center. But if I slide from the right section, I'm going to get the buttons. And you can obviously control it, none, left, middle, right, anywhere, or you can set an activator gesture. If you came from Android to iOS and you want this button, this tweak is made for you. If you wondered how does my control center have that vertical look, that's due to CC Smooth. Unfortunately, if you want to get that tweak, you can't install Horseshoe, Noctis, or any control center tweak. Since it's going to be a little bit cluttered, you can try it, you may like it, however, with no tweaks other than CC Smooth, it's going to look that way and it looks really really clean. The next tweak is favorite emojis which changes the most frequent emojis used with custom favorites. You here type your favorite emojis list, save the emojis and respring your device by clicking apply changes and now when you go to your emojis keyboard over there, you're going to see your favorite emojis that you chose and you saved over there in the settings of the tweak and now when you click on any other emojis it's not going to save in the frequently used it's only going to save your favorites and the last tweak is switcher controls which adds the control center toggles in your app switcher alright guys that's the end of the video please don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel link will be on the screen and on the video description below also if you like my jailbroken iphone setup click on the card in front of you to make the same setup thank you for watching this is purple tech signing out